what's up everybody and uh welcome back to the channel that's how you do it <laughs> listen basically i need to get in my content back so i guess i'll submit and i'll take y'all on my little adventure real quick uh, i just basically got back from Publix. Did a quick little shopping trip. Uh, if you've been following Bay on Instagram, you know, like, she's been in her gym bag a lot lately. Uh, probably going consistently for, like, probably, like, three months now. Um, you know, her personal trainer and everything. So, it's it's been hard, like, trying to find uh, good food, like, high-protein, high-calorie stuff uh, on a consistent basis, like, to uh, have. And it's been, like, hard for her to really find, like, snacks and stuff to eat in between. Like, she's finding that she's not eating enough um you know to kind of help with her gain so uh this is just my attempt to kind of get some ideas together and uh help her out for the rest of the week um if you could see here it's got a couple of little things man um you know some stuff for breakfast i'm gonna make some uh banana nut muffins and kind of get some stuff shaking here we're gonna have some trail mix uh stuff for tuna she likes sardines and um you know those are high in protein so that's like a good snack for her um Boiled eggs, scrambled eggs, cottage cheese, all that. I'm finna get all that together real quick for her. Um, tonight, we're gonna do something quick. We're just gonna have like turkey burgers, but the rest of this stuff, I'm gonna prep it up uh, for her. So, um, yeah, man, I'm gonna take y'all with me. Um, I bet y'all can't tell me how much I paid for this little bit of groceries. Shit is crazy. But anyway, I'm gonna pick back up with y'all in a minute. Next thing I'm actually about to start making is the muffins. Um, I just wanted to give myself a little bit more extra time for the muffins. Honestly, I've never been much of a baker at all. Um, I could cook all day long, but if you need me to bake something, uh, yes, it's not a good look. But I'm, I'm going to attempt this real quick. So if you keep seeing me look at the box, please disregard. Um, look, I already messed up because, right... I was reading it real fast and I was saw that I needed some butter. I'm assuming like I needed the butter softened. So I went and put the butter in the microwave trying to like defrost it real quick. Cause I don't really have time to let it sit out. Um, ended up melting the butter, had to throw it away. And then um, ended up defrosting like more butter and getting it nice and soft or whatever. Then I come back to the box and the butter doesn't even need to be softened. It's supposed to be melted. So I could have just used the melted butter that I thought I messed up earlier. So if that gives you any indication of how well of a baker I am, I, first of all, I don't really read directions. So this going to be rough for me. I, and if y'all haven't seen, uh, this is the mix that I'm using. Uh, it's like a protein mix. Um, mostly for like flapjacks and waffles, but there is a recipe on there. Like if you want to turn it into muffins, banana nut, blueberry muffins, they got all that on there. So, uh, it's definitely good. It, it don't taste like it got protein in it or nothing like that. It's, it's pretty good.
Y'all probably won't hear this from me. Um, babe, I'm probably want to um, tell you about this um, on another vlog. but Or maybe on the same one, but later on in the vlog. I don't know. But we did just get some uh, really good uh, news regarding uh, the medication that we was waiting on uh, to kind of get us started. And we, we did get it shipped today, so we should be expecting it maybe tomorrow or the next day. And so we'll have everything that we need. So the next time that babe uh, starts her cycle, uh, we can kind of get going. And hopefully we'll be trying for our first insemination real soon, y'all boys. Baby Z! Yeah, I'm crump. I'm ready. I'm ready for my little baby. Well, I feel like Nisha finna get me a boy, and I'm gonna slap her ass for real. <laughs> like, what is wrong with you? It's all right though. I'm I'm cool with whatever um whatever God bless us with, man. I'm cool with that. All right. looking too bad we gonna see i'm about to put them in the oven all right so the next thing i'm about to get started on is the turkey burgers um very very simple man i'm just gonna season these up real quick i got my seasonings right here got my breadcrumbs um usually when i make burgers especially if i'm making like more than a pound um i'll put breadcrumbs in them I'll throw an egg in there as well, just to kind of help it all bind together and blend. Uh, but for the turkey burger, really the only thing that I'm going to throw in there are the breadcrumbs and the seasoning because I just don't want it to get too soft. Um, the ground turkey already comes very, very soft. It's easy to manipulate. You're not going to need nothing to help it all bind together and stuff. So... I just throw some breadcrumbs in there to help it kind of stick together. Next thing I think I might make, I think I'm gonna start on her breakfast for tomorrow. I'm just gonna make her two hard boiled eggs, a sausage link, and I'm gonna pack her up one of the muffins for tomorrow too. Um, I made her like three meals and two snacks. She said that was kind of her goal for eating. So for breakfast, we're going to do that. Um, I forgot what I put for the snack for tomorrow. I think I said sardines with uh, saltine crackers or something like that. No, I lied. I, I said uh, apples and celery with peanut butter. And then for lunch, uh, I got some sliced turkey for her, some Swiss cheese, some cheddar cheese. So she could take that, do like some turkey roll-ups or something. Put it on Hawaiian bread, whatever she want to do. And then her next snack, I think I put for sardines and saltines. 
And one more thing, I can't remember. But um, and then for dinner, I'm gonna make her a piece of salmon, some uh, just some like mixed veggies, some cauliflower, broccoli, uh, snow peas, stuff like that. Something simple, but it's a full day's worth of food. She ain't really got to worry about you know trying to figure out what she gonna eat and trying to like carry stuff and all that and try to. She does work at Winn Dixie, um, so. She usually is there before she goes to the gym, so she be trying to pick up stuff there. But it's it's hard trying to make stuff and, and grab stuff like at the last minute, um, in the grocery store. So I'm gonna try to get this together for her real quick. And that's that, man. Quick little burger. Yes, sir. Yeah, they on point. I'm about to get started on this tuna. In the meantime, I got baby breakfast getting ready, sausage and shit, boiled eggs. About to get right. Okay, so next up, I'm going to go ahead and start working on the tuna salad. Love me some tuna salad. Uh, my tuna salad has to have a lot of crunch uh, and a lot of spice. So um, I do put like diced onions in there. Sometimes I'll use salad cubes. Today I am going to use some, but I definitely go crazy with the diced jalapenos. And I just got me a new jar because we run through that like crazy. I love diced jalapenos, so it's nothing for us to run through one of these little jars. I already got my eggs over here cut up. Onions over here cut up. Finishing touches on this tuna. I ain't gonna be bussing. Yes, sir. That's him. That's him right there. That's Timothy. No cap. <laughs> Do I sound like an influencer yet or no? Breakfast done for tomorrow. Tuna done. Dinner I'll cook tomorrow. I think I'm done. What? Oh, shoot. That wasn't too bad. I'm just going to prep up this celery and these uh, apples for tomorrow. Get her peanut butter put to the side for her snacks. She'll be good to go, man. I don't want to hear your mouth for the rest of the damn week. Hey y'all, what's up? I'm back with another update. This one's way better than the last one. I did order my medication this week and I received it today. So let's go do an unboxing and see what we got. Baby, can you get that for me, please? All right, so we got 
a sharps container to dispose of the syringe once we use it. We also got uh, some gauze and alcohol swabs. I have a prescription for a letrozole, and then we got a prescription for a progesterone. Also, this is what was in this bag. It looks like this because this has to be refrigerated. And this is an insulated bag and it has like a couple of um, these ice packs in it. Because they overnight it through FedEx so they have to keep it cold overnight. So they um, put it in like that bag, insulate it. And this is the trigger shot. It comes with already pre-filled. So it's already in there. We just need to use it when we need it. Also has to stay in the refrigerator until we need to use it. So I'm going to put this back in the refrigerator. Thing, but this was the medication that was out of stock from i mentioned in a couple of videos that i posted this was out of stock this is the one i was waiting for that one's the uh, progesterone they gave me double the dosage because they gave me a different brand which is less milligrams than the original one that was out of stock so that's why this is so full I have that's that i'll put what they are and what they use for and what they do and all the extra stuff in the next slide so y'all can see it's just too much to say. We also got a couple of like just papers in that bag. They're just information about what's in the, the order and everything. That whole box had like these four little items in it, but as you can see, like on the box, it says uh, refrigerate upon arrival, so that's why I had to open it without y'all. But yeah, y'all, so everything is now, everything is everything. Cause I said that last time and it was not, <laughs> it literally was not, but we got everything we need. So yeah, it's very exciting. Cause now we just wait for the time. Like literally that's all we have to do now is just wait. Are you excited, baby? Yeah, we can make a baby tonight. Oh. <laughs> you don't want to do that? Thank you. Uh, I'm screaming. Okay, <laughs> but thank y'all for watching our video. Um, I'm going to still keep y'all updated like I said I would as much as possible. So from here on out, just be out looking on the lookout for the updates because they're going to be coming. Baby.